Hi, today I'll be talking about one of the most requested features on JellyPod so far, transcript editing. So what you'll end up doing is going to your podcast, finding the episode that you want to edit the transcript of, hit edit episode, and here's the edit view. On the left side, the familiar stuff, editing title, description, making wholesale changes on the outline, adding new chapters, reworking things, uh, and then of course you have to um, hit the regenerate transcript button. But if you want to make more sort of granular edits, uh, then you come here. So if you need to add in some branded keywords, you want to add in a new section. So all you do is you go in here and you edit it very much like a uh, like a Word doc. So here I might want to change you know, JellyPod to a branded keyword. Here I see there was a, um, a question asked by Sandra. It's full on automation, right? Well, maybe uh, this is where Eric would want to respond with, um, you know, totally. And what's cool about JellyPod is you start it off with a bracket. And you close it off with a bracket, and then automatically the opposite speaker is selected. So these highlighted texts that you'll see like showing up uh, throughout your transcript are these interjections where you know you can click in and change who's the one saying it, um, but it's configured to be the opposite person uh, from the one speaking. Um, what's also cool is uh, if you're at the bottom of any speech block, you can hit enter and start to create brand new um, speech blocks. Uh, this enables you to say add in a an ad or add in an entire new di uh, dialogue that didn't yet exist um, to really take this thing to the next level. Really, what we believe transcript editing all, is all about is taking a podcast that's ninety five percent good and really getting it to that hundred percent mark. So just like that, transcript editing JellyPod. Thanks so much.